Hello, my name is Brenda and I'm the admission counselor here at Missouri State for diversity outreach and recruitment. If you're receiving this video, it is because you may qualify for the Inclusive Excellence Scholarship at Missouri State and we want to strongly encourage you to apply, especially since the deadline for the scholarship is coming up at the end of the month on January 30th. And again, I can't emphasize this enough. It can be very beneficial for you to apply and the sooner you get started in the process, the better. But I know that scholarships can be a little overwhelming in terms of what is required of you when applying. So the purpose of this video is to go through those requirements with you and also talk about the essay a little bit in terms of what it is you could write about to just make yourself stand out as an applicant. So to jump straight into the requirements for the scholarship, we want you to at least be a part of one of these three different groups or categories. You don't have to be a part of all three necessarily, but again, you do have to at least be a part of one of these groups in order to qualify. So the first group listed on the description of the scholarship is going to be if you are from an a historically underrepresented group. The second category is going to be that you are from a low socioeconomic background. This takes into account your family's education level generally as well as your family's income, annual income. And then the third group is that you are from or you are going to be a first generation college student. This means that neither your parents or whoever your guardians are have a bachelor's degree. So neither neither one of your parents or guardians have a bachelor's degree completed college. That makes you a first generation college student. Welcome to the club. <laughs> I was a first generation college student. Um, so again, I know how difficult that can be. So essentially what we want you, once you kind of decide which one of those groups you fall into, it might be all three of them. We recognize that holding one or more of those identities can be very challenging for a variety of different reasons. So for the essay, what we would like you to do is pretty much write about those challenges, the difficulties you have faced, again, regarding one of those three groups. So historically, being from a historically underrepresented background, being from a lower socioeconomic class, or being a first education college student. So talk about those and how the challenges that you have faced regarding those um, different groups or aspects have encouraged you to progress and succeed and pretty much get you to where you are now, <clears throat> even in the face of that adversity. So essentially, we want you to reflect on the lessons that you've learned and the things that you've taken away from your experiences, from your identities, and how you plan on bringing that to Missouri State and using that to contribute to MSU's um, initiatives and a mission of diversity here on our campus. So if there's any roles too that you have had uh, during your time in school, whether just as a member or a leader of any different organization or group that was directly related to social justice, diversity, or inclusion, anything like that, we strongly encourage that you write about those as well in your essay. Of course, those can definitely make you stand out as an applicant if these initiatives are already something that you have been working towards as a high school student. If so, I definitely commend you because that's awesome. But definitely tie that in and talk about, again, how you plan on taking those experiences, both personal, professional, academic, how you plan on bringing that to Missouri State and weaving that into your experience here as a student. And we just encourage you that you highlight any of those roles and um, just, you know, talk about that in your essay and what that has taught you and what that's going to continue to do for you and how that's going to continue to push you once you're a student here at MSU. So if you are to become a recipient of this uh, scholarship, maybe this is a little motivation to apply, you should know that it is $4,000 per year and the total potential over four years is $21,000. You also get $1,000 for every year you live on campus and you get $1,000 for a study away voucher as well. So the scholarship's also going to provide you the opportunity to join a cohort of students who have also earned the Inclusive Excellence Scholarship, and you will essentially work with our Office of Multicultural Services during your time here to help lead different programs um, focused on that cultural awareness. So last thing I will mention is that deadline again. So you have to make sure that you have applied to Missouri State and applied for the FAFSA, the Free Application for Federal Student Aid, no later than January 30th. Again, no later than January 30th. Um, make sure that you have applied for, applied to Missouri State, applied for the FAFSA, and then completed the application for this scholarship. 
We'll include all the necessary links in the description box below. And again, don't hesitate to reach out to us if you have any other questions.